In May of 2013, when the news broke that someone was murdered in broad daylight in the shopping center of an upscale North Texas neighborhood, to say it was shocking was an understatement. And the backstory reads something like a movie script, but this was all real. 43-year-old Juan Jesus Guerrero Chapa and his wife had finished shopping and returned to their maroon Range Rover in a parking lot at Town Square in South Lake when two Mexican assassins drove up and shot the husband multiple times. The wife was not hurt. Two gunmen, known as Clorox and Captain, are still on the loose. Three men who tracked the former cartel lawyer, who is also a U.S. informant, used high-tech surveillance and GPS monitoring devices on his cars for months. They were convicted and sent to jail. The man accused of orchestrating the murder for hire, Jose Rodolfo de la Real Hernandez, also known as El Gato, is believed to be the head of a cartel in Nuevo León in Mexico. During the trial of the others tied to the case, it was revealed El Gato wanted revenge for his own father's murder. El Gato is currently on the FBI top 10 most wanted fugitive list for interstate stalking and conspiracy to commit murder for hire in regards to the South Lake killing. On Sunday, the Mexican Attorney General's office tweeted out a statement that Villarreal Hernandez was arrested in Mexico City. An FBI spokesperson says they're not commenting on the arrest right now, but plan to release more details possibly as soon as Monday, shedding more light to a decades-old crime.